High-performance computing uses supercomputers and computer clusters to solve advanced computational problems. Computational problems that require computing power and performance that is beyond the capabilities of a typical desktop computer or a workstation. These large computational problems exist in numerous fields, such as science, engineering, or business. In the beginning, large and very expensive computers with multiple processors were built. They were called supercomputers. These supercomputers operated as a single system and worked to solve these large problems. This evolved over time to smaller, just as powerful computers with fewer and more specialized processors that shared their memory. They used fewer processors and smaller chips. So instead of hundreds and thousands of processors, they went down to four to eight and used more focused instruction sets. These new processors were different. They were called vector processors and could perform floating point computations at a greater speed than before. What followed due to ever-increasing memory requirements was the usage of distributed memory, where each processor had its own dedicated memory space. For this to be useful, the processes needed a way to communicate with each other. This required a message to be passed. With this began the era of distributed memory computers and message passing. Thanks to message passing, computational workloads could now be run across multiple commodity servers, all connected together via a high-speed networking link. This was vital to the development of HPC, as it allowed an ever greater number of organizations to solve their computational problems at lower cost and at greater scale than ever before, as they were no longer limited to the computational ability of a single system. This was a key development in terms of democratizing computational clusters, and is the way we build high-performance computing clusters today, using multiple servers, often referred to as nodes, working over a high-speed network together as a cluster. This has brought high-performance computing to an ever-growing number of users and use cases. And now, high-performance computing is available to anything from individuals to organizations of all sizes. And thanks to these developments, there is a solution for you. Whether it is in the public clouds with access to an almost unlimited number of computational resources, or a cost-optimized private cloud, delivering the most value for performance and full sovereignty, or as a private bare metal cloud, delivering the ultimate performance and flexibility, or any combination of these as a hybrid cloud. Whatever it is, there is a solution for your use case. Canonical has got you covered. Our solutions for high performance computing are available across all clouds and clusters. We offer solutions such as Charmed OpenStack that allow you to have your own cloud and we have mass for those looking for the ultimate experience in bare metal cluster management. So no matter the size of the computation, Canonical has the solutions for you. Contact Canonical to find the right solution for you.